I'm beginning to think that the shorter quarters are probably as big a handicap to them as any team in the competition. We gave the, I told you those figures on uh, red time. They are they ranked uh, third in points differentials for time on scores last year, um, and uh, not a great starting team. They're only ranked seventh uh, first ten minutes of quarters on score differentials. But they're clearly a, time, a team whose relentless pressure and tackling and corralling takes a toll the longer the quarter goes. Now, you shave uh, – well, we're losing 21 minutes per game. So, you know, five and a bit minutes per quarter. That is very critical time in terms of being able to assert that physical dominance and have your skills come to the fore. And I'm just – yeah, I know it's very early days, but I'm, I just can't help but think – this reduction in time is having a pretty big impact on them. It appears to be a major factor, doesn't it? And the reduction in season could be another problem for them because uh, certainly last year they played their best football and really got their you know, teeth sharpened, their claws sharpened in the last third of the season, which almost doesn't exist this year. In terms of game time, their modus operandi in 2017 and I described them thus, was as the boa constrictor. <clears throat> mm. Those three final wins were three of the most comprehensive wins in finals history in yeah. consecutive matches, and they all played out the same. A first half where they were not that concerned about scoring, but they took the they almost took the life breath out of their opposition in scoring as well. And then in the second half, they could move Dustin Martin forward, and every goal they scored must have felt like to the opposition two or three goals normally, because it was so hard for their opposition to score. But this came after a real battle of attrition that lasted full third. You know, it was in longer quarters, and they are simply not getting the time, I feel, to put that very successful way of playing into, into action. And, you know, when you're a team that has played together for so long, because this team has not had all that many changes... Uh, players come in and out, but there's a core group there. They know, and I know this of great teams, Rowan, they know that it's red-time football that wins games, and they do not panic. They love the last six or seven minutes of a quarter. Mm. It's almost as though that doesn't exist anymore. They, yeah. they, they are ready for it, and the game, the siren goes, and they're back in the huddle. 